I have two boys, they're ages seven and six, and a two-year-old daughter. Chelsea Cox has three little mouths to feed. The Decatur mother relies on the Supplemental Nutrition Assistance Program, or SNAP, to put food on the table. Towards the end of the month, sometimes I worry how I'm going to feed them, or what I'm going to feed them. The Arkansas Department of Human Services will begin issuing February SNAP benefits two weeks early in order to make sure funding is available. Cox says she's grateful because this month hasn't been easy. It's just we don't make enough to pay for our house, our bills, and food. It's, there's just no way to afford that on minimum wage jobs. But in the back of her mind, she thinks this is not a good sign. I know that if they're giving them to me earlier, obviously the government shutdown is affecting the food stamps or they wouldn't be giving them to you earlier. So I just worry about the future. DHS stated today this is not an additional payment. So DHS is encouraging participants to budget accordingly for food purchases. So now it's up to Cox to make her food and her paychecks stretch until March. Put clothes on your kids that fit because they're constantly growing. You're constantly having to buy new something. And that's just more to worry about when you have to worry about the food too. Indicator, Peyton Yeager, KNWA, Northwest Arkansas News.